we're here at Tom's place. Uh, just outside of Mammoth. At the top of Sherwood Pass. Oh, thank you for that correction, Wes. I mean, come on, if you're going to do it, it's not right outside of Bishop. I am going to earn, you can see I don't have as many cool stickers as Wes because I haven't driven as far as Wes. But I'm going to earn my, uh, where the heck is it? Where did it go, Wes? Uh, Tom's Place, right? Here. I'm going to earn my Tom's Place sticker right there, so we'll see. Hopefully they have one. We're going to go in and eat some good food right now. And Wes is treating. <laughs> no, Bye. You yeah, this is Wes purchasing a sticker for me, right, Wes? Again. I mean, how much more do, can I have? You're a witness to it, right? I'm a witness. I'll, I'll witness. All right. Oh, look at it. See, look at it. He's got all kinds of cash. I'm thinking this is a good thing. We call him the giver. Well, some, someday it's going to come about at about face, right? You're going to have uh, to pay it back? He back? Oh, no, this is what it is. He owes me terribly just oh, for being his friend. You know. I, it's kind of a rental fee for being his friend. All right, I'm Larry with Man Cave Mayhem, and this is? Chuck. Chuck, where are you from? I'm from Palm Springs. Palm Springs, all right. We're from Hesperia, actually. Yeah. We rode the scooters all the way out here, so. Wow. Yeah, they're, they're, we call them Hardleys because Hardleys? they're hardly a bike oh, dear. at all. They're hardly a bike at all. Pretty good. Pretty good. <laughs> Anyhow, thanks for talking to me. Oh, no man. problem, man. You, nice you just up here enjoying the weather? Trip. Yeah, we're having a good trip. Right you just up here having yeah. having a good time? You know, we came up for my father-in-law, had a little memorial. He died a while back. Oh, I'm and sorry. We went out on Lake Crowley, and we did a little fishing today. That was his favorite place. And you know, My wife and her brothers are in there. That's awesome. Well, it's nice to meet you. Did you get any fish? Pardon? Did you catch any fish? Oh, not, not on Lake Crowley today, but yeah, North Lake at 8,900 feet up in the Sierra. Oh, out of Bishop. beautiful, oh, yeah. huh? Oh, yeah. Totally beautiful and big trout. Oh, nice. We great. caught four trout yesterday morning. Great. All right. You guys have a wonderful trip. You have a good, safe trip too, right, sir. Man. So this is what Wes is eating, and this is what I'm eating. And you know what the thing is? Is Wes is probably gonna hog my plate too because he's a piggy. But this looks pretty good. But we're gonna get to it. I think Wes is gonna get to it. You know? Why wouldn't I? And you, you what's your name? Rose. Rose. Uh -huh. Rose, I'm Larry. Larry, nice we're, to meet we're you. Do, we got a YouTube channel too. Oh, really? So you, yeah, I'm what? gonna put you on it. If no that's okay. way. <laughs> yeah, it's called Man Cave. Two separate words. Man, man Cave. Mayhem. Man Cave Mayhem. Yeah. So give so me a couple I, weeks to get it up, okay. and you can watch it. Okay. Thanks Here's so much. Your lunch. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> man Cave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, all right. Okay, we're leaving Tom's place. We're in Lee Vining, and Wes has taken me to some hokey pokey museum. The lady decided she wanted to build a house upside down. Looks like uh, they're looking upside down out of the windows and stuff. There's a bunch of old mining equipment, it looks like. What do you think, Wes? Well, it's closed, but you can't see. It's a little dark in here. You can't really see what's going on. The house is upside down. I'm going to get a backup view of the upside down house. I guess she really wanted to just kind of show off this. There it is, upside down house. Woo! Pretty cool. But we're uh, near Mono Lake and we're getting ready to head back. And you'll probably hear a bunch of wind because it's windy. Bye.
Okay, we're at the Fern Creek Lodge. Just got through uh, doing the footage of uh, June Lake. And uh, I guess we're gonna go down, finish the June Lake loop, right, Wes? Yeah. And uh, she was telling us that we um, might encounter some deer and some bears. See, we're not supposed to feed the bears. As you can see, but we're not going to do that. But let's go in and see if she wants to be on the YouTube channel. Hey, hey, you got to come. You, you guys want to be on my YouTube channel? <laughs> man Cave Man, all right? Oh my God! You, you guys are celebrities. Celebrity? All right? Yeah. Okay, let's see. This so, one. Man Cave well, Mayhem, look it up. It'll be on in about 15, two weeks, ladies. Okay? okay. All right. We'll see you. View pretty spectacular right there. Hmm? That's all for now. Remember, ladies, don't forget man cave mayhem. You'll be celebrities in a minute. See ya. We're back at camp, it's getting chilly. Beautiful sky, though. Look at that. Got some beautiful sky, and uh, we're getting ready to cook some food. There's our little lights that we bought. They're kind of cool. They fold up and they light up pretty well. They're just solar lights. You get a blow into it, dummy. Yeah, I didn't knock that over. You knocked that over. You no, no good bum. But we're getting to we're fixing Din Din, and uh, it's gonna be good. Having a little mountain house tonight. So, and we're probably gonna try and gather some wood for the fire. So we'll talk to you soon. This will be the end of uh, day two coming up here. So, and it's been a good day. Right, Wes, do you think? Oh, it's been a great day. Not bad at all. Scooters have uh, survived. And uh, so we'll see you soon. All right. Day two's in the tent, in the bag, whatever you want to call it, in the can. Anyhow. In my home? No, no, my home. Anyhow, we're done. We're, we're done for the night. <laughs> it's like very tiring riding scooters, especially with Wes. <laughs> He's an idiot. Good Hi, night. This is Larry with Man Cave Mayhem. I hope you enjoyed episode three of our 700 mile scooter trip to Mammoth and back. Remember to share, like, subscribe. And uh, those people that don't want to watch it, just force them. You can tie them down to a chair or something and just force them to do it. Anyhow, just remember. I'm just a man in a cave causing mayhem. Thanks.